Hi guys, on this video I'll be showing you how to make a HP or health bar in scratch. So I'll be showing two methods how to make a health bar on scratch. So the first method is using the pen extension. The second method is using costumes. So let's get started. So first I'll be showing you how to use the pen extension and make a HP bar. So click on this add extension button and choose the pen extension. And then paint a new sprite and then draw a small circle and name it as health bar and now click on my blocks and let's make a block or render health bar x add an input called x label y add an input called y label called health ohp and I input health and another label called width input called width add a label called size add an input called size and then make sure you tick run with our screen refresh and then click OK and now when we flag click we need to set ghost effect to 100 and then forever grab this render health bar block and then we need to set the x to grab a operator grab a minus and go for sensing and you see this backdrop of stage and change it to cat so I have the cat and X position minus 33 then grab a plus operator duplicate Y position of hat plus 70 and we need to set our health let's make a variable called health for all sprites and then click on hat when we flag click we need to set health to 100 then set health to health and I'll put the width like 1.5 and the size to 6 so okay now let's define this block so click on pen and grab a pen up and we need to erase all and then we need to go to x x and y y then click on pen and we need to set our pen color to black so this is the color of the outline of our health bar and then set pen size to size plus 8 
grab this size then grab a repeat grab a divide so 100 divide the width we need to grab a pin down and change our x by 1 So duplicate the same thing and then we need to set our pen color to like red and just set pen size to size and duplicate this and we need to set pen color to green And we need to repeat, it's not 100 divided by width, it held divide by width. And pin down and change x by 1. And then grab a pin up block. So okay, now let's test whether our HP bar is working. And now you can see we have our HP bar and it's working, you can see. So you could change these positions by the X and Y and the width. So like if you add a small value, it will make it long. And if you enter a higher value, it will make it short. And you could change the size. And you could also change the color of the HP bar. So that's our pen HP bar. So now I'll be showing you how to make an HP bar with costume. So I have uploaded a sprite, so name it as HP bar. And I have 11 costumes. Named from 0 to 10. And when green flag clicked, we need to forever switch costume to grab operator plus so HP or health plus one. And if you click on cat, I will set the HP or health to 10 and lock normal readout. And when this sprite is clicked, I will just in the health by negative 0 0.5 and now our health is 10 and now you can see if we click on our sprite which is the cat our HP decreases so now you can see it's negative 1 but our HP is still showing that grab a lesser than so if health is lesser than 1 then we need to hide else show go for control stop this script so I'll provide the google drive link if you want to use this HP bar so this HP bar is from a scratch project and now you can see, okay, put a show block on top. And now you can see our HP bar is working. So that's it for today's video. And if you like this video or find this video useful, make sure to give it a like. And if you want to get more updates from this channel, make sure to click on the subscribe button. 
and turn on all the notifications and if you find this video interesting or useful make sure to share it with your friends so see you with another awesome squash tutorial